In this question, we have a box and whisker diagram as shown. We are also told that the interquartile range is 20 and that the data set has no outliers. In this question part, we have to find the minimum possible value of u, the upper quartile. To find the solution, we recall the method that is used to test for outliers. Since here we are looking for the upper quartile, we'll use the formula that tests for outliers that are much larger than the rest of the data set. So when using this method, we take the upper quartile and we add 1.5 times the interquartile range. If any value in the data set is larger than the result of this calculation, then the given data value is an outlier. The key here is that we are told that there are no outliers in this data set. This means that the result of this calculation must be larger or possibly equal to the biggest data value in the data set, so 75. This is so because otherwise 75 would be an outlier. Substituting 20 for the IQR, we get that u plus 1.5 times 20 is greater or equal than 75. 1.5 times 20 is 30, so we get that u is greater or equal to 45, and from this it follows that the minimum possible value of u is 45. Let's see some tips to help you get full marks here. The first one is that the method to test for outliers on a box and whisker plot is not provided in the formula booklet, so make sure that you remember this method. Keep in mind that this method has two parts, one used to test for outliers that are much larger than the rest of the data set, and the other to test for outliers that are much smaller than the rest of the data set. The second tip is that you pay attention to what the question exactly asks and answer accordingly. Here for example, it is important that after carrying out the calculations, you explicitly state that the minimum possible value of u is 45. If you don't do this, you might not get full marks.